Hey Sassy Ladies, it's Sunday. Hey Sassy Ladies, um, it's me, Kevin. Um, two of you know me, Brittany and Deanna, I'm friends with them, but the rest of you don't, so hi. Um, I am here to do our Sunday video. It's Sunday. Um, not really. It's actually Saturday at 6 o'clock, but we'll pretend it's Sunday. Um, I am going to ask you some questions, and um, you guys will learn a little bit about me. I've been friends with Deanna for a few years now. Um, through I was met her through her brother, who I worked with, um, and then I met Brittany through Deanna, of course. Um, I then found out about you guys, that all the sassy ladies, um, through Deanna, and I started watching your videos, um, I think it was like around the 30th video or something I started watching, and I've been watching it ever since. I think you guys are awesome. Um, I love like what you do and how you kind of just tell about your life and talk together. It's a good way, it's a good like community, and I, I, I like that. Um, I... Uh, I guess a little bit about me. Um, I love singing. I love acting, dancing. Um, that's like my passion. So that's like I want what I want to do for the rest of my life. I'm um, currently enrolled for the fall of 2000, um, 2010 at um, the University of Southern Maine for musical theater. Um, I'm really excited about going there. I was supposed to go there in uh, this this coming semester. But I couldn't afford it, so I, I deferred my enrollment, and I'm really excited about even just deferring my enrollment because I really, really want to go back to school. Um, but for now, I guess I'm going to just work. I work at McDonald's. It's kind of the lamest job in the world, but I mean, it pays the bills. And um, I'm a huge Harry Potter dork. I love Harry Potter. Well, I have read all the books. I've seen all the movies. I'm going to see the next movie when it, the night it comes out at midnight, and I'm dressing up. Because I'm awesome, and <laughs> so I'm very excited about that. Um, I love reading. Um, obviously, I read, read Harry Potter, but I read a lot of fantasy books. Um, I'm currently reading a bunch of plays, and I'm in the middle of um, Ovid's Metamorphoses as well, which is like a Greek. I think it was Greek. Greek. Um, it was in Latin, and then it was uh, the uh, it translated from the original Latin into English. It's like a 550 page poem about all these like Greek gods and transformations into things. It's it's really really good. It's hard to make my way through. I'm about halfway through. So I've been reading that. I read A Raisin in the Sun, which is um, an amazing play. And I'm currently reading The Laramie Project, which I was actually in in high school. Um, and I love that play. There's a lot of good um, monologues and stuff for auditions that I'm so I'm kind of picking some things out for when I have to go and audition for shows soon. Um, so that's what I'm doing. And I want to know a little bit more about you, so I'm going to ask you a few questions. Um, if you could be anything in the world and sustain, like make a living on doing anything that includes like things that you clearly can't make a living out of, but if you could do anything, like make a living out of anything, and what would it be? For me, it would just be singing. Like, I could sing at anything and just be able to make a living off of it, like do private gigs and or be in a band or be on Broadway like I want to be or all that stuff. That That's what I would do. Um, what else? What do you think is your your personal style, I guess? Um, like, what, like, your style of, like, what you wear and how you present yourself. And um, mine is kind of like, I don't know, is dressy casual, I guess. I kind of tend to wear, like, collared shirts, and then I'll wear, like, a jeans underneath, or I'll wear, like, layers, and I'll wear, like, just a t-shirt, but I'll put a blazer over it, and then wear my jeans and, like, a nice pair, like, a, a cute pair of sneakers or something. That's my kind of style. Um, um, what are you reading at this moment? I know a lot of you are reading Sex, Drugs, and Cocoa Puffs, because you guys are doing the, um, the book club thing. Um, what else are you reading? Are you reading anything else on the side? Or what are you watching? Um, and any suggestions for things that I should be watching or um, or 
listening to music. Um, I really love music. Music's like obviously since I was just saying I love music, so I love kind of any the wide range of music from classical to metal to musicals to pop to rock to everything. Um, and if you could use two things, if you could use one word to describe you, what would it be? Um, mine would be <laughs> original. I I guess because I'm kind of like. I like a lot of stuff, so it's like I'm kind of a lot of things. I'm not just like one thing, I'm a lot of things. But I'm very original in like the mixture of things that I like to do and things that I enjoy. Um, and what's one word that you use a lot? Or like a word that you tend to like have in your vocabulary for no reason? Um, it's kind of just like mind changes every once in a while. So right now, um, I would say I use the word I'm using the word like bomb which is kind of lame because it's like a 90s word um but I'm saying like that's bomb or that's cool or blah 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 it's it's stupid it's just in my vocabulary and I don't know why in this video I would say the word that I use a lot is um because I keep saying um every five seconds but I can't and I can't stop it's my first video so um it's my first video making like making my first video it's my inaugural video with you guys so I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I can do this again because um, I really like the Sass Ladies and watching you guys and being on it. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy your week. You follow all the rules. You swallow all the stories. And every night you wish on a star. Dreaming your day will come. Trusting in allegories. And every morning, boy, look where you are. Until you confess you're lost in the wilderness. Don't you ever watch the eagle fly to the sun and wonder how it got to be so free? If you ever have, you'll know your journey's begun. Hey, what do you got to lose, boy, when already we are lost?